Hello everyone, Mortuari here and welcome back to our Soul Mask series and yeah, let me turn my HUD back on. Um, I did a few things off camera, I made a little extension to the base and yeah, uh, everything with regards to the crops seems to be working fine. I have been getting some um, seeds and whatnot in these boxes and there is cotton being produced as you can see corn is getting produced and all those kind of things but I need a more steady supply of uh, food and leather products so animal products and for that uh, the plan for today is to actually uh, set up some uh, breeding pens and uh, slaughterhouses and whatever and get some uh, baby uh, turkeys and things like that but in order to be able to breed we actually need a few things and I already prepared that so first things first turkey coop if you want to keep some turkeys we need to put them in a coop second thing i have is this breeding farm which i will be needing and i think that's about it then there is also the traps which i will be needing to capture uh, our first babies and put them in the breeding pen so i will be building all that up here and i think maybe i should start with the breeding pen there you go put that one down somewhere in the middle maybe something like this should be a little bit in the middle i think that is three from this side and about five from this side okay let me pick it back up and put it a little bit more in the middle yeah this might be happening a few times i try not to be all too precise with these things but I just hate it when it's not uh, really all oh, that was at one two one two three four yeah it should be a little bit better like this okay so this is where actually everything will be happening so you can appoint someone to this and apparently I have a few options who isn't doing a th Thing. I think uh, maybe later Hosen should be doing that. Mm, yeah, let, let's give it to later Hosen here. So, uh, what will happen is once uh, we have our breeding pens up and running, uh, later Hosen will be taking care of it, uh, feeding them if necessary, uh, also getting uh, the byproducts out of there, and maybe also slaughtering them if necessary, and all those things but before we do that let's first place down our uh, turkey coop no the turkey coop is this one okay this is the place where the turkeys will live in a fiddling around i was hesitating because i'm not sure if they need to have access to the back or not because this is where we can pick up the eggs and the feathers and all the things and the fishes as well so yeah i wasn't really sure if that's necessary in the front you would be putting in the food and on the side you will be putting in some water some uh, water for them so now the main thing is to go get some turkeys and how do you get turkeys well if you have killed them already you will find them in your hunting log uh, hunting log not this one here and you will look and i didn't kill any turkeys yet so it doesn't really tell me what i need to do for those so i will have to go kill a turkey before I know what to do well i actually already know but once you have killed one it will show you down here what type of bait you can use to catch a, uh, a turkey luckily i do think i have some turkeys in the area yeah there is a turkey up there Ooh, that's already baby turkey actually oh, yeah let's go let's go kill the the big turkey so i can show you what i mean Okay, so I have killed the turkey, press and hold for the hunting score, there you go, save data, and then if I go back to the hunting log, hunting, or hunting gallery, see now it shows me the turkey, and turkey, you can catch turkey by using nuts, locusts, poisonous bug, peanuts, and all those kind of things. So let me go get that. I should have some, uh, some bugs in storage already. Because, uh, yeah, bugs are also created by uh, the farming plots here. Uh, the in insects are collected from here normally, I think. 
Do I have some bugs? Or are they in here? Uh, poisonous bugs. I could try to use those. Yes, I think it worked. L. No. Okay, for hunting, I will keep making that same mistake. Yeah, poisonous bugs will work as well. But if not, then I can simply go catch some, uh, some little thingies. Or the bugs. So what I need next is uh, a small trap for the turkeys. And I will need to put the bugs into the trap for me to be able to catch them. Now the goal is to approach them. Is that a little one? Yes, that's a little one. So be very quiet. Try to approach them without them noticing you. And then you place down a trap. There you go. And now if I go close enough, I can actually arm the trap. And then let's put uh, some in there. Doesn't really matter how many. There you go. I'm not sure it will get that close to us. So I will try to place a few traps. Maybe one more on this side. You just need to be careful that you do not spook them. If you spook them, they will run away. And then you will have to start over. No, not that. But this, for example, let's... Oh, did he hear us? I think he's hearing us. So let's put some in here. And now back off a little bit and check what it will be doing. Is it moving? If it is moving, then it might be coming into our trap. Okay, this is moving a little. Hmm. Let's try to get a little bit closer. I think it is moving towards the other trap already. Let me try to find an angle where I can see the little turkey and the trap. Yeah, there is my trap in the distance. So up there is my trap and now we just have to wait until the little one gets into the trap without being spooked. So I hope that none of my uh, clans members will uh, come out and spook the turkey away. If not, then I will have an easy catch of the first one. Uh, in my other play session on my uh, public server, uh, I, I had a, a lot of trouble getting a turkey. I always spooked it for some reason or the other. And it took me, I think, about five or six attempts to actually get a turkey in one of the traps. So it is moving slowly, but steadily towards the trap. Now, if there was a big turkey here as well, then uh, you need to be careful that it, the big turkey doesn't go for the trap and eat the, the bait instead of the little one. So if it goes into the trap and starts eating the, the bait, then the trap will trigger and it will close itself up and the little one be, will be captured. Is it a male or a female? It is a female, that's good. Females lay eggs. I'm not 100% sure if, if in this game it, it really needs to be a male and a female, but I will try to get a male and a female in there. So it is getting closer and closer to the trap, as you can see. It is almost in the trap. It should be eating something soon. It's not. Why not? The trap isn't triggering. Does it still need to move a little bit more or what? Okay, let me fill this up too. Hmm. That is strange. Let me see if there is more turkeys around. That's strange. Did the graphics not get updated or... Uh, Should have 
closed by now. Let me try to get close enough, and if it didn't work, we will try again. That's strange. Yeah, now I spooked it, Dylan. It just had to eat, I guess. Okay, okay. You know what? I know where the trap is. I can leave it up there and try to find another one. Look, there's another one up here. Let's sneak up to it. Okay, let's place a trap up here. That might be a big one, actually. It's going for the trap. Let's see if we can get this one. What's this? Okay, stone, I can't see it. So the goal is you set a trap, you put some bait in it, and then you hide and you wait. It's a waiting game. Now try not to get it spooked too much. Because if it hears you, it will get spooked and it might run away. This one we are close enough to see what actually happens. So it is going in the trap. I guess now we will have to wait. Until it starts eating the bait. Or maybe I should be using those uh, normal locusts instead. Oh, the trap. I think the trap closed. I heard a sound. Yeah, the trap closed. Nice. So there should be a turkey in here. If I can see it. Wait a minute, where is the turkey? Turkey isn't inside. Well, that is kind of strange. Huh. This is a first. It is in... I think it is inside. Aha, I got it. Capture turkey. There you go. Now the main goal is to run back home and put it in the turkey coop and that will be our first turkey. I think pretty sure you need a male and a female for them in order to start breeding and once they start breeding of course they will be laying eggs, they will be producing feathers and they will be producing poop as well. The eggs you will be able to use for some cooking recipes, the feathers you will be able to use for um, arrows for example. Okay. So we're in the coop, simply drop it, or put it down, then go back out, maybe close it a little bit. And there should be... a turkey inside. Yep, here it is. I don't know what type is it. I forgot to check, is it a male or a female? It's a male, okay. So if I can get that little female one, that would be rather nice, actually. So we already have one turkey. Lederhosen should be on his way. I should be producing or trying to produce actually some turkey food as well. Let me check if I can do that. Uh, the cooking pot. Can I make some turkey feed? Yes, I can. So let's make, I don't know, about uh, 50. Should be a good start. And let's go check on the other one. 
if it has entered the trap. If not, no problem. I will try to find another turkey and we will do the same thing again. You see, it's, it's way up there. So I, I need to be a bit more patient. Wait, isn't that where I put up my other trap actually? Yes. It's in the other trap. Perfect, perfect. Here we go. I have a male and a female turkey. Now, uh, if need be, I can go find another female turkey to speed the process up a bit. But normally, they should start breeding. They should start producing uh, eggs and stuff. And we should see the, see the results of for that. So, yeah, that uh, should be also um, my meat covered a little bit because you can set the uh, coop up to actually start slaughtering um, the animals once you have too many of them. I will show you what that is in a minute. Let me first of all open this up and put the turkey inside. There you go. Put the turkey down. So we have a male and a female. Close the door. There is already some food in here. As you can see, the locust are already in there and he is putting water in there. See, Lederhosen is doing what he should be doing, which is awesome. Okay, I might be trying to get uh, one more. If I can find one in the area, I surely will be gathering one more. Let me first go and clean up the uh, turkey straps I have placed everywhere so that I don't uh, leave any mess behind. You never know, someone might be wanting to trap a turkey as well. Okay, there is a trap here, yes. So, retrieve. You can't. Okay, then dismantle. Get my uh, poisonous bugs back. And check the other ones as well. Yeah, I will leave this one open. You never know if there will be another respawn of uh, turkeys in here. Then I might be getting it. But meanwhile... I will have a look around and see if I can find some other turkey babies. Oh, they're all... Oh, no, those are monkeys. Those are monkeys. Uh, not the same. They're not the same animal. Not the same animal for sure. Okay, I'll have a look around and see if I can catch another turkey. If not, then uh, I will be seeing you guys again after this. Okay, I'm bringing you guys back because I found another female baby turkey. And I will be trying to... Oh, darn, did I... I have no more traps on me. Can I make a trap? Nope. Oh, darn. I will have to go back, back to base. I think I need the, the crafting station for that. Yeah, okay. Okay, let me go back to base. It's not all that far. And make myself another trap really quick. So yeah, I have two turkeys already. In the coops, I left this one uh, turkey trap up here. You never know. Uh, it might get triggered, it might not get triggered. And if it does, I have an additional turkey. That, that's fine. So I have my this one and I need a small... Oh no, I should have some in the box actually. Do I have some? Nope, I didn't make that many. Small trap. Let's make one and go catch that... Uh, third turkey baby so of course it will take a while before they are full grown uh, do I have it on my hotbar yes perfect so let me get out and go back up there it's not all too far it's just over this little hill here actually I need to be careful because there is an alligator in the area as well Wait. is that a living turkey yeah it is Okay, it's not here. It was up here though, or am I mistaken? Oh, there is another turkey, that's the turkey I killed. Okay, it's in this area then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's try to get a little bit closer. That is a parrot, shouldn't be no problem. 
let's try to place the turkey pen or the turkey chap up here. Wait a minute. Put some uh, feet in there. Uh, yeah, that should be enough. And I'll back off. And do the waiting game. I think it's walking in the other direction though. Ah, it's turning. So yeah, it's going to be a waiting game until it gets in the trap. Then you need to wait a little bit until it starts eating. And if all goes well, the trap should close itself. You should hear a sound. Oh, it's the, the bird. Okay. You should hear a sound that the trap has been triggered and I should have a third turkey ready. So let's be a little bit patient and see what we can find or if we can get another one. It's a female one, so that's, that should help too. Come on, come on. Eat. I am not sure if the, the, the sound of the trap is something new, because I don't remember hearing that, actually. Oh, it's not in yet? No, it's still walking. Okay, now it's getting closer to the trap. Yeah, it's a game of patience. Especially those little ones, they are not all too fast, so yeah, it takes a while. But if you're patient enough, you should be able to get a turkey. And you can do the same thing with other creatures too. I know you can capture monkeys, I know you can capture parrots, I know you can capture uh, probably some tapir or the other, uh, the other, oh, the trap closed. Perfect. And I might be doing that too at some point. Uh, there is a turkey in here normally. Uh, do I have to wait again? Yeah, probably I have to wait. Just like previous attempt. You need to wait a bit. Look, there is a, a small capybara. So I might be trying to set up a capybara pen as well. Yeah, why not? Getting that one on land might be a little bit harder. Do I have the copy bear already unlocked? Uh, it's the... No? Oh, yeah, true, that's new. It's this one. Hunting. The copy... Copy bear. Yeah, the copy bear. Could use some nuts. Or some fruits and veggies. Some quinoa. But especially nuts. I don't think I have nuts. I will check. Oh, eggs. I didn't even notice. Oh, come on, Turkey. You should be ready by now. Huh. It is inside, is it? Or is that? Yeah, it is inside. Oh, capture the Turkey. There you go. Capture the turkey, now also dismantle this, clean up immediately. So if I want, I could come back later on and place the trap in this area again. Because I think close to the nests, you're probably, probably going to be finding some, uh, some babies too. Okay, let's bring turkey number three back to the base and check how our little turkeys are doing. They should first be grown into adults and then they should be uh, making babies. <laughs> I should probably check if I have some nuts lying around. If not, I will have to go collect some. Uh, maybe I already have a few in my pockets, I don't know. So maybe one of our uh, turkeys is getting closer and closer to being full grown. I think with three turkeys, it should be enough to start. Uh, might be a little bit slow, but I have time and patience. Okay, let's open up, up, drop you off, up and close you 
Okay, let's have a look at the uh, turkey farm. So here you can set up what type of food you want to give to them. Uh, yeah, probably not quinoa, peanut or cashew. The rest is all fine. And here you can set up at what uh, at what rate you should be killing off animals. So if it's 80% full, the coop, it will start killing uh, killing off the animals, slaughtering them for food. I put 70. So there is now three in there. After a while, you will start seeing feathers and poop appear and they will be growing up okay next one we can do is maybe try to get that capybara i will be trying to make a capybara um what's it called a breeding thingy a pen that's what i wanted to say i think it's in here oh no i didn't have any a pen so the capybara pen i can make that let's make one and set that up and maybe we can try to uh, capture that small cup burger on the other side i won't be going through the process uh, uh, too many times it's always the same thing i haven't done the cup burger yet so it might be good for me as well to actually give it a go but first of all i need to set up the cup burger pen of course as long as i only have one cup burger baby they will not reproduce at least not that I'm aware of. That one is huge, actually. Okay, okay. So I think for the copy bearer, I need uh, not this one, not this one, this one. I need the large traps, the uh, medium traps. Let me check. Uh, yeah, medium trap. And they produce fresh meat and beast hide. And if you would check the turkeys, it will say a small trap, fresh meat, feathers. They also produce eggs and, and uh, f um, fishes. So might be helpful as well uh, let me pick up a medium trap and check if i have some nuts lying around a medium trap did i bring the medium trap already uh, am i blind or am i not seeing all too well wooden chests thatch box did i have a medium trap i don't think so you know what let's uh, let them make one medium trap Uh, let's make a couple. Okay, and meanwhile, I will be going outside and uh, try to get some uh, nuts. So I'll be right back after that. Okay, time to bring you back. I was able to get a few nuts and I made some medium traps. I actually already had some, but okay. I have a, a total of seven. And let's try to get that one copy better. Um, we will see how it goes. I'm not sure. I have not done that yet. So it's new for me, it's new for you, but we should be able to get it. At least I hope so. What is that? A small turkey, I don't need a small turkey. I want this one. The question is, will it come to our side or will it go to the other side? The little one is pooped already, which is fine. So if I would set it up here, would that work? It's already running away. Okay. So, six is a big trap. I just hope the uh, big one will not come and eat the nuts. It doesn't. Wait. Bait is not suitable for look for clues in the hunting gallery. Wait, wait a minute. Oh, it's cashew and quinoa. Oh, I have some pumpkins at the base. Potatoes I have too. Okay, let me uh, go grab some. Oh, and I have the corn. Of course I have corn. 
let me go grab the coin really quick and then uh, then uh, we can continue yeah I should have plenty of coin actually I've been making coin for days already Okay, I'm back. Another cover of darkness. Um, I will be trying to put some uh, some coin in here. I hope the big guy doesn't come and get it. The little one is way, way, way further up. But I have another trap if need be, so... Just need to be careful that I don't not spook it. Let's place one here as well. Six. Oh, he is probably already going to the other trap. No, no, no. Big guy. Don't. Oh. He's turning. He is turning. Cool. Oh look, not a small turkey up there. Well I'm I'm set on turkeys, it's the coffee barrels I want. Let's wait. stops. Now it's moving again. I think it's it's inside and I heard the trap close. Yeah, I think I got it. Yep, yeah, I got it. Pick it up. There you go. I have copybara. Ah, I didn't know it was that easy. Oh yeah, something else. Uh, I've been hearing some people complaining about the fireflies, how to get fireflies. Well, you see, when around nighttime in darkness uh, near water, so lakes and rivers, they start flying and you need to make a net. And you just come here, swing your net and you will get some fireflies. In case you are wondering how to get fireflies, that's how it's done actually. Okay, let me bring the capybara home and uh, wrap up today's episode because I don't think there is not a capybara close by and I will have to wait until it respawns uh, to capture the same one again I guess so I will be putting it into the pen I might be opening this up actually putting a staircase down here so I can enter the, the base from another side too okay almost there then the only thing I need to do is probably make sure that I have some food for the capybara, which is probably going to be corn. In the first place, of corn, I think, yeah. Almost there. I can drop it off. Maybe next episode, I will be doing some building, finishing up uh, the base a little bit. Um, I need to collect a lot of materials for that, so it will take me a while. Oh, yeah, true. It's this one, not the turkey coop, but this one. Oh, where is the door? Oh, there is the door. 
open it up, drop you off. There you go, little capybara. Do not run away. Okay, E. Set it to also 70%. Yeah, I don't really care what put, what gets put in there, probably not. Bananas, tomatoes, potatoes, well, potatoes, I don't care. Pineapple, guava, guava, refined capybara, state, oh, soup. Wild fruit, nuts and peanuts. So corn and pumpkins is fine. I can I can make those. What was that? I heard a sound. Or is that a little capybara? Could be, could be. So yeah, that's uh, that's how things go. That's how you will get some animals. Uh, he will be putting in some feet and watering it. So I should not worry about that. And after a while. He will be dropping everything off in here, which is generated by uh, our uh, animals here. Let me check, maybe there is already something in here. Nope, I don't think there is. Nope. This one is almost full grown, actually. So yeah, uh, in a little while, these will be full grown and they will start producing meat and eggs and feathers and then I will probably be doing some automation to set up uh, the cooking and stuff like that. And of course I need to extend or build this little base here. And that's going to be for another episode. So yeah, we did quite a few things today. We got uh, three turkeys. I got one capybara. I will be trying to get a few more. But all in all, we did a great job. So that's going to be it for uh, today's episode. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did. Feel free to leave me a comment, a little like, a little subscribe is welcome too, as that helps out everything YouTube-wise. And I will be seeing you guys in the next episode, which will probably be a building episode, but knowing me, I might be changing my mind after all. So, thanks for being here. Talk to you later. Goodbye.